Hey guys, I'm Zach Fu for Easy PVC Projects. Today we're going to be building the Spider Dolly by Zach King. You can check out his YouTube channel Final Cut King right here. Now, this project's a little on the harder side, but if you follow these instructions, you'll build one in no time. Here's what you'll need. Eight one and a half inch pieces of PVC, two five inch segments, six T's, four elbow pieces, one coupling, and eight PVC end caps. Then you'll need eight 5 16 hex bolts. Make sure these are two and a half inches long. Eight 1 4 washers, 16 5 16 hex nuts, PVC glue, and eight skateboard wheels with bearings. I've already put mine in. Now that we've got our parts, let's start building. Glue one elbow to one of the T's by using a half inch piece. You'll do this four times. Glue a five inch segment with a T and also insert two one and a half inch pieces. You'll do this two times. Glue the elbow pieces from step one with the T pieces from step two. Then glue those pieces together with the coupling. Try to glue these as straight as you can. Then spray paint your dolly and all of your end caps. This step is optional, but I highly recommend it. Then drill a 5 16 hole in the middles of all of your end caps. Try your best to make it as centered as possible. Now let's assemble our wheels. First put your bolt through the wheel, followed by a washer, then a nut, an end cap, and then another nut. So that's a washer, then a nut, an end cap, and then finally another nut. Then drill a 1 4 inch hole into your coupling. This is for mounting your camera directly to the dolly. You can also drill a 5 16 hole in case you want to connect a tripod head to your dolly instead. Now just plug in your wheels and you're all set. Lastly, I usually use PVC pipe as tracks for the dolly so the shots are smoother. But it still works pretty well by itself on smooth surfaces, so it's up to you. So that's it. You can leave any questions you have in the comments section below, and I'll answer them as soon as I can. Thanks for watching.